Hey guys, welcome back to the Shake with your boy AJ. I'm your girl in the books. Today we have. Today we're gonna to be talking about some news um, from Jamaica, um, from the Jamaica Zoo. The attendee got his hand almost ripped off by a lion. That's what I just said. Yes. Um, and we're gonna be talking about Rihanna giving birth to her baby. Woo! Everybody's been waiting on Rihanna give, for her to have a baby, so. There you go. And we're gonna be talking about the mass shooting. I know everybody heard about it. I know everybody like it's sad. Um, we're gonna be talking about it and going in depth about that one. That one is you have to stick around for that one. And we're gonna be talking about amigos, guys. Some something is um on the horizon. Either a beef or either they're trying to do marketing scheme, but we're gonna be talking about that. So you guys stick around. And guys, we'll have the top five trending truck in Jamaica. Guys, just stick around. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And feel free to comment in the box with down below. Uh, follow us and our show, y'all. Uh, we'll be right back, guys. Magnum, me link up my dog, them bunny bad drum. Me sell up a strap, I'm a fire some boy, I what, what is that big split fully chip and we rich pass the brick Now me fling it on the pretty little bitch Watch a girl my youth cause she want for something I will lucky like thunder, dog get them one be one away And not try violate cause the cock you know it chip And the money where me flick, you can feed your family pa Okay guys, welcome back Okay, guys. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Yeah, you don't have to give us too much of that. Okay, so we're gonna be talking about the um, Jamaica Zoo incident with the attendee, um, the attendant. Sorry, not the attendee. The attendee would be people who go there and uh, not them. So what happened was the um, attendant was showing the to, um, guests, not only tourists because Jamaica go there to so some Jamaicans go there to so some I'm gonna say the guests. He was showing the guests um the lion um that was their final part of their tour. And what had happened was he was trying to make it more very appealing and interesting to them. So trying playing with the lion and no one kitting and the lion grabbed his finger in his mouth and tore off a piece of it. Um I'm gonna play the clip and then we're gonna talk about it. It's not gory, so YouTube should not have a problem with it. I'm gonna play it right now. Look, 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 look at this. Somebody come look at this. Look at this. Somebody come and look at this. Look at this. So, I think it's see everything that I just said that's what unfolds. Some of the guests were like they thought it was a, a arc, yeah. Because it no, it's true thing though. I, I understand what they're saying. Cause sometimes when I go to some of these places, like they have they put on a show for you, so like you would not think say it's not part of it because you think they're trained, you think they're trained for this, but it's not. It's real. When when the guest says she um see the the person's finger, his finger um get severed and he fall back and he's crying and cussing, swearing explicit, then she was like it's serious and run away. They should so, they should have um keep that part on the camera longer so I could see when he's crying. Yeah, for me that was like uh something real dangerous for a person to be doing at that time at the zoo. What the fuck? You don't even know the animal like that. I mean, you but I mean? don't you think if they're hired for that and they're experienced workers as 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 they're supposed to be for that, don't you think that I I don't think it would be dangerous for them because they're experiencing that, right? They're working at the zoo um, it, in, and experiencing that. I just think he was carried away and too um 
aggressive. Negligent. It was too aggressive with the yeah. lion. Before you get that bite, it was a little bit too aggressive because he shoved the fence and like yeah, two times saying. and the lion rolled, then he put back his finger in there. I don't understand that part because after the right lion get mad, this guy still put back his hand in there like he's trying to pet the lion. Like he was just trying to suppose. bring up excitement, I guess, for the guests, you know, so he can make it. Do you think he wrote that? That's a big point. He, he does. He's an he's a, he's a attend, he's a, he's a, he's a attendant. Yes, that's what the news is. Is um saying. Oh, that's why he's moving like that. So um, okay. he was just trying to entertain. I guess you know how people, them the people, and maybe yeah, maybe there was some tourists in there. So you know what I mean. You get a little bit too aggressive. I see that, and the lion see that shit. You know what I mean? But you don't play a lion. You don't play a lion. I hear them say them say don't um you must you should never put down in a lion's cage unless you want to get bite. Okay, guys. We're moving on to the best news ever. Your girl Rihanna, everybody who adores and loves her, she finally has a baby. And she welcomed her baby boy um, on May 19th, I think. Yes, I get the information right. It's on the news article. Um, yes, yeah, so she welcomed him. Um, no, sorry, she welcomed him May 16th. So, yeah, she welcomed him May 16th, What's May the name 19th. Of this baby now? We're not gonna, it's not revealed. Oh. So May 19th okay. was when everybody knew, but May 16th was when she um, had her baby. May 19th was when everybody knew and it was happy, joy for everyone because some there's a lot of Rihanna stands. So, my girl Rihanna, you got a baby, you have your man, you stay long and, and try to pick who you know would be the right one for you, the right match. I hope you guys continue to stay together and blossom. What do you think about Rihanna having a baby now? Well, I think everyone can have a baby and free to have a baby. But uh, I see Chris Brown sending some um, blessing Rihanna's way. You can see the, the picture or his story right there. Um, I think for Rihanna, I think it's about time for her to have a kid. Because she's around, she's in her 30s, right? Yeah. Yeah, she's in her 30s, so it's that time and ASAP Rocky. I'm not sure much about ASAP Rocky because I don't know him like that. I don't know one track that he sings. I just know him because of controversy on the internet. So um, I'm sending them blessing, blessing their way. You know what I mean? May 13, guys. What's that? May 13. Sorry, what? just correcting the date. May 13. Okay. So don't quote me on that. I know you guys love quoting people. Yes, that's you guys mix up. Anyways, moving on to the most. Disturbing news ever. Um, first of all, I just want to send the condolence to all these ten people family. Um, you guys, please help us say their name. Please comment down below. Share this this specific video. Even if you want to only share this part of the clip, share this part of the clip. Share, share, share. Make it aware that these people are just going into these neighborhoods and just gunning down people, and they don't give one f. And these people are being painted as nice little innocent people. There's this news clipping that's painting this teenager as a nerdy little teenager who gets bullied. This is how they start it off and then they say, oh no, they want to do suicide, homicide, um, murder, suicide. No, he wants to, he, he went into the neighborhood, I'm telling you the story, he went to the neighborhood, um, target this designated neighborhood what was filled with black, um, race, people he didn't go into the neighborhood and just started killing people and then said he wants to kill himself no he went into there for the the fact that it was a colored neighborhood i want to say it loud i don't care about youtube right now so the people who died 10 i'm going to just give you their names and what they were or who they were and you guys need to say their name loud and proud make sure everybody know their name go out into the street and say it. first one Cecile Cecil 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 um, Shatney 65 she was a cancer survivor a church goer and a bingo player Roberta Dury she um, was 20 30 32, sorry, beloved daughter and sister who moved home to help her brother fighting cancer. Audrey McNeil, 53, who stopped at Tops to buy his three year old son a birthday cake. Three year old son. The, the, he's gone. His three year old son will never ever see him again, okay? Let's yeah. just get that oh, here. Yeah, that's so sad. Catherine Cat Massey, 72, a writer and a civil rights and education advocate. 
Margus D. Morrison, 52, school bus, eight survived by his wife, three children, and a stepdaughter. Hayward Patterson, 67, father and church deacon who fed the homeless and gave rides to neighbors. Aaron Salter Jr., 55, retired police officer who died trying to stop the gunman. Mm -mm. Garladine Pally, 62, expert baker and friend to everybody. Ruth Whitfield, 86, beloved mother, grandmother, and great grandmother who was caretaking taker of her husband. So her husband has nobody to take care of him now. Pearl Young, 77, who run the local food pantry and loved singing, dancing, and her family. That's all of them, guys. When you look at stories like this, guys, it's really sad. Really sad to see that we still live in a world where people. Um, just coming and destroying people like because of hate crime because judging someone of the color of their skin and all that shit. I feel like this ain't gonna stop until, as I said, I always say this like four years ago, I've been saying this. We need to put a law in act where when you kill a colored person innocently, you get the death penalty. Death penalty. I don't care who you are. Death penalty needs to And that's the only way things are gonna be changing around here. And I don't feel like. The government doing much about this situation because it keeps happening over and over and over again. I feel like they're just talking and then one idiot gonna go again and kill people. This kid's no innocent, no bully kid. I don't care what happened to him at school, he's not the only one who get bullied. Right. And it also start with the, That's it. And it also start with the parents at home. How you teach your kid because racism start at home. For me, I believe so. Racism start at home. Not out there what you see in the street, it start at home. You know what I mean? So I feel like this sick um, kid who hate uh, hate themselves and hate someone else because of their skin tone, they need to get that penalty right away, immediately. I don't feel like they need to go into jail and go eat tax pay money, no, that's not even right. They, there, um, there is like no remorse for these people whatsoever because the fact that someone they murdered these people were murdered in cold blood this person know what they were doing it's a premeditated crime bro the man said on his life he's going to target the area with the most colored people bro he documented this and shit it, and it, it's it still it's it. still that he's not even he's not even getting he's not, he's not convicted nothing he's bro this kid is gonna get probably insanity it's gonna be the insanity. The, the lawyer said he's not guilty. How effed up is that? I feel like this is gonna stop any. I don't feel like this is gonna stop any time now, because they're not doing nothing to change our, the justice system of killing black people or anything. They're not putting no act, no no law in act. If you kill a colored person for no reason like that, especially with the police too, they are police and these random guys who going around killing people. People talking about they get bullied just for them to look okay. No. No, that has nothing to do with bully guys. That has a lot to do with hate. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? That's just it. I'm sorry to say. What else do you have to say about this one? Condolence to all the family who died. So um, I hope the ones who were injured survive and they're healing. Um, yep, we have to stand up and, and, and once and for all and just make our voice be heard and let them know that this is not right and that person is definitely deserving of some sentencing. There has to be some sentencing. There has some to be a life sentencing too. It's not gonna be a 10, 15, 17 years. That more than one life you take. It has to be a life sentence. And if it's not a life sentence, y'all yeah, will see. Let's follow this case up and we'll see what happens. What next we have? Now, um, we're going to be doing the Migos. So, as everybody can know, or as everybody noticed, that um, the Migos have been um, on the, the brinks now. So, Offset and Cardi unfollowed Quavo and Takeoff, and Quavo unfollowed unfollow, um, Offset and Cardi B. Um, but, you know, Takeoff take off is not follow, unfollowing anyone. Um, but Takeoff still follow us, right? Takeoff still follow both people. Um, so, they wanted to know if it was a true, the rumors are true, so um, TNT was asking Quavo, Quavo 
if you want if you could comment on it and he said no not commenting on anything like that so it looks like they're 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 speculating that it looks like it's a beef then we had our our our, our friend our guy um academics you know he's he's big in the in the industry like talking with them and getting like what's going on with their life so he was close he's close to offset and what he said was um no they is it, it's not anything about them falling off are falling apart um he's saying it could be a sure. selling meca ne mechanism like what we were saying but on the internet you know how it goes they're speculating saying they want to um time to sell somebody's soul time to do something for them to gain you know so we just have to keep watching this case because this so guys, case is another so guys, one let me give you guys a straight follow-up on this story so offset and Take off and Quavo, they have a little thing going on. They say there's a split in amigos. I'm not sure if it's true. What could cause a split? I'm not sure if there is even a split. You know, this can be a scheme for more sales. I feel like Take Off and Quavo, they're coming with a album. They did a track in the hotel lobby. They called, they can take it out on YouTube or your favorite platform. So I feel like there's something really going on. I'm not gonna say it can just be a scheme. I feel like there's something maybe going on. Because I heard a little rumor saying one of the Migos should be sacrificed. And uh, yeah, so something is really going on with the Migos. Sending them healing energy. I know uh, Takeoff and Quavo and Offset, they, they, they're good team players. Um, I'm not, I don't think it's something real big serious where they're gonna hate each other forever or stay away from each other forever because they're family and they're close. It's not like they're far. So uh, let's follow up on that story and see what's going on. What do you think about this story? Um, I think it's a, I think it's a sales mechanism. We, I don't, I don't know. It's too, too sticky and and like Quavo is a a, a guy who was street fighter and jump foot. Uh, him, him straight forward. Uh, him not go just hide nothing if something like that. Like them, them a fight or them break up or them done. Because Quavo is a guy, you know, you see him, you've been seeing him, like him and somebody get in an argument, you already want to show hands. You want somebody, you, you see them, you see it all over the, the media, videos, whatever. So, I mean, if something serious, serious was going on, I think Quavo would say, yeah, um, we're done, that's it. Um, we're breaking But he, did, he refused to answer. He refused to answer the question. Or which they're no. trying to do something, but let's see how this plays out. Um, your girl, Imani. Been missing off the gram, off the social for what, a couple weeks? Ivani. Ivani been missing off the gram for a couple weeks. I heard in Mexico they captured some Jamaican who was videoing how they crossed the border to go to America. I never seen nothing like this. I heard nothing like this before saying someone's going on a crime and videoing themselves live. So, guys, definitely watch until the end so we can give you these quick updates with the new secrets and reviews to give you know the meaning behind the things you missed. And so, basically, the sources confirm that Ivan is still trying to cross the mix. So, I feel like that was stupid of any Jamaican who go on the border and make video of them trying to get a better life according to what they're thinking in the US. So, I feel like Ivan can be one of those persons who is missing. So we just gotta treat, um, pray, pray for her and all that, and let's see if she's still alive or see what's what's up with her. You know what I'm saying? What else we have? Um, yeah, and that that's all our topics we have for today for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed them. Okay, guys. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. You can you guys can comment and tell us, fill us in, tell us how you guys think about the channel. Um, how you think about our topics. And all that. Um, guys, let's kick it into the top five training truck in Jamaica. Bam, let's go. JB Production. Six. Hey, JB, you don't like a good name, you no want it, me need it, believe me, no leave it Me treat it like secret, me hide it, me keep it I lit, me clean it with double D40 Rifle do leading, chip lock for this evening Open the head down, we lock down the neatest Reach quick, the drive by, do better with V6 Me three trick the crowd and escape over neatly Yo Fuse, come and send up town, down town Mad, no guy in a ramp with Jim Brown One brother music, when people go for Go for no. Side 
best thing I make the dog just reason Fuck him, I go on with the no man, I come so better listen Me no send the enemy go prison I'm a love for them, feel if I give him If I pussy this, my shot, they do that drip, my love so got me Murder people at the top, it take a step in my office And if you're good, they don't so end with your style Crying in the cold like them, man Diva chat long, chat Straight to the action, in chalk up, but you take no caption None, shot done boy in a tracks man I'm a man, I'm a need no option For a fly if you slip, no traction Do it if you feel so far on a run March on my s- Hello mate, what's funny hard Monday? Now your place when the cuss I win the chase, get straight to the pace from a day in the race. Tell him none of them are safe. Left for telling now your face. I'm done, 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 Got the gun, my dog from a very, very hot. It does. You know, strike force is just a man. Yo. I saw my step on the scene, I mean. I mean. Look how my clean and a little whitey. I'ma do what the fuck, I'ma please, what you mean, yo? Who for them rap, them lick, they made my jeans, I take talk from my naga. A piece and none in a disturbance. Right now, I feel like me are the new Shabarang, so I'm talking to bring to the Daniana, man. You know, she's a real lead out, yeah. Be a rival, but shoot past them in my skyline. You know, she died, yeah. Highs from my rocks. All of my jaws, them fully intact. Old gun, man, spun yard. Execution style, we know jack that. Hit a bones all both when they done. Bloody money come fast, I'ma spend it off quick White people blood, me put in a guard ring Pony line, touch a river, I'm pay my offering Sacrifice in my time, I'm put my all in Cool, cool Travel pan it all, put it in a sport mode Looking at the lucky is a hundred load It's how a diesel a chum chum a nose hole Boat, more Back road, girl sucky with the ensure Give me brains right to the Benz tour Just as sensible you feel if a ten floor Okay guys Uh You have anything to say to them? Uh, no We're Um, getting there to our Subscribers and just want to thank you guys. I appreciate you so much. The TikTok page is made. It's down below. Link and guys, the merch. We have new merch coming out this summer. Um, next month to be exact. So uh, we're going to have the link in the down below. Where you can click and get your merch. So that will be coming soon guys. Until next time. Bye. Peace.